Hello. Hi. Hi, <laughs> Hi Haley. How are you guys? How are you today? We are good. Good. Perfect. Are you ready for the English class today? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. Good. Do you have the books with you? Yes. Yes. Everybody has a book? Yes. Yes. Do you have a notebook as well? Yes. Yeah? All right. Good. Okay. Let's see who is here. We got Charmaine. We got Roseanne. Jolene. Chloe. Herlidia. Elaine. Sean. And... And... Okay. Good. Good. We're all here. Now, start with a song. First, we're going to hear a song and you are going to tell me what are we going to talk about. Okay? Are you ready? Yeah? Are you yeah. ready? Yes? Yeah. Okay. First, we're hearing this song. Let me just put it over here. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's go, let's go. Okay, let's listen. <clears throat> Yep. Sleeping over the sea, wearing my big warm coat. I, I'm in a plane. I fly around the world and fly back home again. We love to travel. It's our favorite thing. We love to get out and see everything. We love to travel. It's our favorite thing. We love to get out and see everything. On a parachute floating down to the ground, but I don't look down. I I'm in a van and I'm waiting here for the lollipop man. I I'm on a scooter, always whizzing around through our wonderful town. I I'm wearing skates, I've got my helmet on. Come on. To travel, it's our favorite thing. We love to get out and see everything. We love to travel, it's our favorite thing. We love to get out and see everything. Aha, uh -huh. interesting. So what is the song about? What are we going to Travel. talk today? Travel. Travel. Yes, good. But do you like to travel? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. I don't really like to travel that much because I'm scared of planes. Really? Why are you scared of planes? The reason why I am scared of crashing. I'm scared of planes. Okay, let's write that down. So, you said that you don't like to travel that much. Can you tell us again why don't you want to travel? Because I don't want to crash in a plane. Oh, I don't want to crash in airplane crash. Okay, we got airplane crash. I also have, I also don't have every I don't airplane know. crashes. No. Never. Yeah. It's going to happen. 
It happens, I don't know, maybe once in so many years, but still, it doesn't happen that often. It's okay. I still okay. also don't like plain. You don't like plain? Ah, okay. Interesting. Okay, good. How about you, Charmaine? Do you like to travel? Yes, I like to travel. Okay, Kitty. Okay. Where would you like to go? I like to huh? go to Thailand. Okay, let's write that let's write that down. Where would you like to go? Would you like to go to did you say Thailand? Okay. Let's see. Let's put this a bit here. All right. Perfect. Very well. Uh, Roseanne, how about you? Do you like to travel? Yes, I love to travel. You love to travel. Good, sweetie. Where would you like to go? I would like to go Hong Kong. Uh -huh. Okay, let's write it down. I would like to go to Hong Kong. To Hong Kong. Why would you like to go to Hong Kong? Because Hong Kong got the Hong Kong Disneyland. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Let's write it down. Why would you like to Hong Kong? I would like to go to Hong Kong to see Disneyland. One more time. Roseanne, why would you like to go to Hong Kong? I would like to go to Hong Kong because Hong Kong got Hong Kong Disneyland. Okay, Siri, look at this sentence. Why would you like to go to Hong Kong? I would like to go to Hong Kong to see Disneyland. One more time. Why would you like to go to Hong Kong? I would like to go Hong Kong to see Disneyland. Yes, to see Disneyland. Well done. Perfect. Good, sweetie. Thank you. Chloe, how about you? Where would you like to go? I would like to go to Canada. To Canada. Why would you like to go to Canada? I would like to meet famous celebrities. Like who? Like many to them. Okay. Who is your favorite celebrity? I think Ariana Grande. Okay. What is Ariana Grande? What does she do? She sings and sometimes she performs. Oh, okay. Perfect. Good. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Herlia, how about you? Where would you like to go? I would wish to go to um to where? Wait, I, I forgot. I forget what's that country name already. Oh. Where is the country? Is it in Asia? Is it in Europe? Where is the country? Asia. It's in Asia. Okay. Uh, Thailand? No. Chi China? No. Vietnam? It's in Malaysia. Oh, it's in my oh, so it's a town, it's a city in Malaysia. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Why would you like to go there? Why? Um, Why? What I would love to go to. 
What do you want to see there, sweetie? What would you like to see there? I would like I to, would see like to see the, the um Would you like to see the buildings, maybe the park, the museum, the gallery, maybe to try the food? I would love to go to KL because I, I want to see the building there. Ah, are they very tall? Yes. Yes. Perfect, sweetie. That's a good reason. Well done. Good. Elaine, how about you? Where would you like to go? I would like to go. Elaine. Yes. Okay, Kitty, where would you like to go? Uh, For example, listen about me. I would like to go to Japan. I like to see a beautiful, let's go with flowers, the beautiful flowers in Japan. They have amazing flowers and I would like to see them. How about you? Where would you like to go? Okay, sweetie, take a minute and think about it. Think about where would you like to go. Uh, Adam, how about you? Where would you like to go? I would like to go to... Uh, I would like to go to Kuala Lumpur. Ah, why would you like to go to Kuala Lumpur? Because the building is so tall. Uh -huh. The buildings are... The buildings are, the buildings are very tall because one building, two buildings. So, <laughs> the buildings are very tall. Okay, perfect, good. Kayan, how about you? Where would you like to go? I would like to go to Sarawak. Okay, why would you like to go there? Because I can see my grandma. Oh, perfect. So you can see your grandma. Perfect. Charmaine, where would you like to go? I would like to go Hong Kong. Okay, good. Sean, how about you? Where would you like to go? I would like to go to Korea. Korea, why Korea? What's in Korea? So I know nothing in Korea, but okay, it but... might be interesting. Ah, okay. Have you ever been to Korea? No, I've been to Japan. Oh, did you like Japan? Yes, I've been to many places in Japan. Okay, what do you like about Japan? What's so beautiful about Japan? I like the sakuras. Okay, good. Interesting. Good. Thank you. Uh, who didn't we ask? Oh, Jolene, how about you? I would like to go. Where would you like to go? Greenland. Where, sweetie? I didn't hear that. Where? Here, you might use. I said Penang. Ah, okay. why would you like to go to Penang? Because I can see my grandma and my and my 
They always say it's my little brother. <laughs> Perfect, Siri. Good job. That's excellent reason. Okay. Now let's look at this picture over here. Do you know what is this? Luggage. Luggage. Perfect. Luggage. Good. Or also we call them suitcase. Suitcase. Or luggage. Suitcase or luggage. Okay, so why do we use a suitcase or a luggage? Why do we use it? We go to travel. Perfect. So what do we put? So why do we use a suitcase? Because we have to take our things to the Perfect. Yes. So when we go travel, we put our belongings or our things in the suitcase. Good. Yeah. So we put our things or our belongings in the suitcase. Good. Very well. Elaine. Do you have a suitcase? Yes. Yes, I? I have a suitcase. Pretty? Yes, I do. Okay, let's go again. So, do you have a suitcase? Yes, I, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. What color is your suitcase? It is what? black color. It's red. My suitcase is red. My suitcase is red. Biddy, let's repeat. My suitcase is red. My suitcase is red. Perfect. Good. All right. That's very well. Okay. You need to put your mute, sweetie. All right. Chloe, how about you? Do you have a suitcase? Yes. A very yes. big suitcase. Okay. What do you put in your suitcase? Do your clothing, swimming things, and also the fun, and also my toothbrush and toothpaste. Oh, okay. Perfect. Very good. excellent. Good. Um, Charmaine, how about you? Do you have a suitcase? Yes. Do you have a suitcase? Yes. Pretty? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Good. What color is your suitcase? Pink color. My suitcase is pink. My suitcase is pink. Good. Okay. What do you put in the suitcase? I will put my clothes, toothpaste, swimming clothes, and other. Okay, so I put my clothes in my suitcase. Good. Okay, now I want you from now on to have your notebook open all the time. So when I type something, you need to write it down, okay? Yeah? Yes, so, ma'am. Yes. Yes. Now, I want you to write this thing over here. Just the blue thing. The suitcase. Why do we use the suitcase? So you're writing this one, not the orange one. I'll delete the orange one, okay? So I'll delete this one. Just Write this down in your notebook. 
So from now on, you're always going to have the notebook open and you're just going to write, you're going to copy everything that I write here in your notebook. Yes, sweetie? Do we have to blank spaces? However you like, sweetie. I just want you to have everything in your notebook. Okay. All right, good. And also, I will show you one trick where you can put all the new words in your notebook. So you're going to have them all in one place. That would be amazing. So when you think of a word that maybe we used during the class, but you forgot it, you're going to just open your notebook. I will show you that in just one second. Once you finish this, I think I'm hot here. Is it hot in your country? Yes. Uh, it's not no. hot outside. No, it's not hot. How is the weather? No, it's not hot. Um, it's sometimes raining and it's sometimes sunny. Okay. Nice. Okay. It's nice. So, are you ready with this? No. No, I'm waiting, I'm here. Waiting, waiting. I copy finish. Perfect, really well done. Let's wait everyone to finish so we can continue. Teacher, is it right the question and the answer? Yes, sweetie, the question and the answer, yes. You don't need the picture, you don't have to draw the picture. <laughs> just the question and the answer on the side. You just copy the old word. Uh. Okay. So once you're ready, you, you can just raise your hand so I can know that you're ready. Well done, Charmaine. Good job. So why do we copy everything in the notebook? So we can learn that. So we can memorize that. Because I'm going to ask you later on the same question and you need to know how to reply. But also, it helps with writing. So it's always good to use the notebook. I finished. Okay, thank you. Teacher, I also finished. Perfect, Elaine. Good job. Almost finished, ma'am. Almost. All right, almost finished. So, once you are finished, I can see in the chat box, in the chat box, that I got a reply that somebody is finished. Let me, let's just clear this out. I finish. I finish. I oops, am finish. Um finish. I am finished. So we got all of these options, but only one is correct. The other ones are not good. So now we're gonna check which one is the like this. Okay. Um, okay. I finish. Is this correct? Is this good no. or not good? It's not good. Okay, so I'm just gonna cross it like this. This is, oops, not good. And I'm gonna put it in red. Okay, nope. how about the second one? Nope. Nope, all right, well done. Cross it like this. Number three. Nope, 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 nope. it's not, nope. okay. How about nope. number four? Nope. That one is correct. Ah, so the last one is correct. I am finished. I am finished. I am finished. 
also copy this, the last answer. I am finished. Or you can you can say I am done. Or I'm done. Or I'm finished. Okay, but the uh, yeah. the camera must be muted on. Jolene, Sweetie, I'm sorry, but I need to mute you on because there is a lot of loud coming from your place, okay? Yeah? So when I ask you something, you just open your microphone to speak, okay? All right, good. Also, I want you to write this. I'm finished. I'm finished. I'm done. I'm done. These ones, the top ones, are not correct. Good, Rosane, well done. You just are you telling us that we have to write the ones that are wrong? Just write the ones that are correct, these ones. So you can learn that those ones are the good ones. Oh, I understand I can, now. Because mm, I can see in the chat box. Sometimes you just type to me, teacher, I'm finished, but it's not correct. So let's just fix that one. All right. One more minute so you like, can copy that and we can continue. It's like it, the I'm name done. is finished. I'm done. Perfect. Good. Yes. Good job. I'm done. I'm finished. I'm done. All right. Are we all ready? No, I'm yep. not. I'm not. You're not ready. Okay, sweetie. I'll wait for you for a second. And let's go. Can, can I go to the toilet? Yes, you can. Okay, let's see. Well done, Chloe. Good job. Jolene, are you ready? I'm almost finished. Almost finished? Okay, I'm, re I'm waiting. I am almost finished. That's good. That is good. A few more words than finished. I didn't hear anything. I just hear. Woo, woo, woo. I didn't. I didn't understand anything. <laughs> oh, it's, yeah. It's just my cat. Yeah, that's okay. Don't worry about it. It's good. Okay. So now, I'm gonna show you three pictures. Uh, you have to tell me what is that because I have no idea. Okay. The teacher, look at the chat. Jolene, are you ready? Really, I'm waiting for you. The teacher can finally look at the chat. All right. Now, let me show you picture. So I'm just going to change. Aha. Then I'm going to remove this one. Now, how about these three things? What is this? This is a flag. This Perfect. is Melissa flag. Yes, good job. Let's write it down. This is a flag. Okay. How many flags can you see? I see three flags. Well done. Three Perfect. Flags. I see three flags. Okay. Let's go with the first flag. Whose flag is this? Malaysia. 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 Ah, good. Let's make a sentence now. Now we're going to say, this is, now I need Malaysia. help with Malaysia. How do we spell Malaysia? M-A-L-A-Y-S-I-A. -A okay, guys, not everybody because I didn't understand that. So... Let's go with, 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 who should I ask? Roseanne, can you spell 
Malaysia for me, please? Yes, I can. Tell me, sweetie. M A L A S I A. What letter is this? M A L Y L A Y S I A. Malaysia, like this. Okay, good. So this is Malaysia, means that this is Malaysia, the country. But we need to add something. So we're going to say, this is Malaysian flag. Pay attention, there is N. This is Malaysian flag. So now I'm going to ask you, where do you live? Uh, Elaine, where do you live? I live in Malaysia. Perfect. I live in Malaysia. So pay attention. We got Malaysian. Malaysia. This is Malaysian flag. Okay. I live in Malaysia. Good. Okay. How about the second flag? Whose flag is this? Or which country is this? Is it England? Mm -hmm. It's not England, but it's the UK. This is UK or United Kingdom. Kingdom. Yeah, United Kingdom or UK. How about the last one? Whose flag is this? America. America. Mm -hmm. It's not America, but is U.S. USA. USA. So whose flag is this? This is the American flag. The American flag. This is the flag of USA. Or we have United States of America. United States of America. Let's write this down. Copy this in your notebooks. So we got the flag of Malaysia, the flag of the UK. This is UK. England is a country in the UK. A UK is like a one big country. United Kingdom or UK, USA or United States of America. But people call it US. You can say USA, three letters, or you can say just U.S. Oh, that's correct. Wait, we have to write them? Sorry. Yes, we do. You have to write everything I write. You need to put in the notebook. That's why it's quiet, because everybody is writing. So, I'm from Malaysia. This is the flag of Malaysia. Or, this is Malaysian flag. Then we have the second one, United Kingdom. Not England, United Kingdom. Two words. And flag number Teacher. three, it's American flag. Yes, sweetie? The, the third sentence, they say, Whose flag is this? And then you, I need to write, this is American flag or this is the flag of write USA. Both of them, sweetie. This is the American flag or this is the flag of USA. Because... Either one. Sorry, sweetie, is what? It either one. You don't want what? 
Is it I need to choose which one I want to write? No, you have to write everything. Okay. Because both are correct. Okay. Yes, Philip? And finished. You're finished. Perfect. Good. I'm finished. Finished? All right. So, almost finished. I'm waiting. You're almost. You have to be finished. <laughs> so, whoever is finished, you can now open your book. That should be page 10. And today we're going to speak about the sports and stripes. Teacher, I'm already done. Mm -hmm, good. Perfect. All right. Now open your books on page 10. Was it 10? Yes, it was page 10. We have two pictures. Two pictures. Let's start with the first one. Picture A. Picture A. Let me just put it over here. Okay, so page 10, task A. The first picture. Let's see, what do we see on the first picture? What do we see? I see lots of flags on one book and the other book don't have any flags. Okay, that was very good. Let's write it down. So, I see In the a notebook. lot. I see a lot of flags on the first picture. Good. Okay. How many flags, Olivia? How many flags are there? There are eight flags. Eight flags. Good. Perfect. Excellent. Okay. And how is the weather on the first picture? How is the weather? Chloe, how is the weather on the first picture? The first picture doesn't have any sun and it isn't sunny at the first picture. Okay. Okay. So there is no sun. There, there aren't any clouds. So we can't tell. Okay. Good. All right. And how many boats are on the first picture, Elaine? How many boats? Two boats. Perfect. So there are two boats. Very well. Good. Okay. Ah. Now, how about picture B, the second one? Picture B, Roseanne. What do you see on the second picture? The brown have person. Uh huh. Is this person walking. Okay, okay. So I can see a person walking. What does he have in his hand? What's that? It's the brown a luggage. Luggage? What was the other word of luggage? Suitcase. Perfect. So I can see a person walking with brown suitcase. With brown suitcase. Good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. What else can we see? Chloe? What else can we see on the second picture? We can see the sun from behind the clouds and also, and also three green flags with gray sharks on them. Mm -hmm. Perfect, good. But these pictures are slightly different. They're not the same. Yes. Okay. It's just like, yes. It's just like spot difference. Yes, perfect. Now let's look at the task underneath. So now we're going to do the first task. There's one boat and it's got three flags with gray sharks on them. Do you see the sharks? One, two, three. Three sharks. 
Teacher. Three. Yes, Vidi? Do I need to copy the sentence? Oh, that's there? okay. That's okay. These ones you don't have to. But now we're going to write this task over here. So, we have one, two, three, five sentences. There are five sentences. The first one. The man with the beard isn't wearing. Where is the man with the beard? I don't see this man. Where is he? Is it picture one or picture two? Picture two. Picture two, okay. So the man with the beard isn't wearing what? Shoes. Shoes on his feet. Aha, okay. That's interesting. But now you have to fill in all the words in all those five sentences, okay? My teacher, I already finished. Yes, sweetie, but I didn't ask you to do that, so now you have to wait. Okay. Okay. Let's do, let's go, guys. Let's do this task. So you have five sentences. Let's write them down. What is missing? Let's go. So, do not do a task unless I tell you to do it, okay? Because now, what are you, what are you gonna do, Chloe, now? You're just gonna sit. So, you shouldn't do that. But okay, now let's finish this. So, be careful with the pictures. Look them carefully. Don't be in a rush. Dad. Okay, good. I'm just gonna write over here. We're gonna do the end. Okay, guys, can you please turn, on your, uh, turn off your microphones because it's very loud, so I can't hear any one of you. So it must be quiet. Okay, I can see you're done. You just raise your hand if you're done. Teacher, can I say the boy is carrying a large pipe in their right hand? Wearing what, sweetie? Wearing large? No, the boy are the. Is it the boy are carrying large suitcase? I don't know. You write down what you think it's good, and then we're gonna check. Teacher. Yes, Jolene. Can can I go to the toilet? Um. Can you go in ten minutes? Cause we're gonna have a break in ten minutes. Okay. Okay. So we're just going to do this. And after that, you're going to have a break. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to put here task B. Oops. Task B. And we're going to write the answers. So we got the first one. And we are going to do the rest of them. So we just got like one example. Okay, let's go with the first one. The first sentence, we're gonna start with, with let's see, Tayen, number one. Cayenne, let's read number one. Okay. The man with. Pretty, I didn't hear anything. I'm sorry. I couldn't hear anything. Hello? Diane, can you hear me? Ah, okay. Okay, your brother is talking. Okay, in that case, let's ask Roseanne. Roseanne, number one, please. Shoes. Please, sweetie, read the whole sentence. 
The man on the bird is wearing shoes on his feet. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's write it down. The man with the beard. Roseanne, can you say beard? Beard. Beard. Perfect, really. Isn't wearing, but it's not just shoes. We're going to add any shoes. Any shoes on his feet. Because he's not wearing, it's a negative sentence. We're going to say any. He doesn't wear any shoes or he isn't wearing any shoes on his feet. Awesome. Now we go to number two. And number two is for uh, Chloe. The sun is coming out from behind the clouds. Vidi, number two. The boys are carrying large suitcases in their right hand. Mm -hmm. Okay. Large suitcases. Good. But what shape are the suitcases? We can say what shape they are. They are square. Perfect. So we can say square suitcases. Yeah. Square suitcases. The other, other one inside the book. The. Pretty. I didn't understand anything. Cayenne. I I couldn't understand anything. Try again. Cayenne, do you have a question? Teacher. Yes, sweetie? We need to copy the... Of course, you need to... The notebook. You need to have the exact, the correct words. So you need like, to have this one. Can test A1? And test if... Two. Okay, hold on, guys. So now you had a task to do. If your answers are not correct, you need to write down the correct answers, okay? I'm typing the correct answers. You need to have the correct answers, okay? I need to switch to another computer. I mean the, the word need to copy inside the notebook. Okay, uh, Roseanne, just one minute, sweetie. One minute and we can have a break, okay? Just one minute. Just one minute so you can check your answers. So, one more time. You are writing the answers in the book. But if your answer is not correct, you need to write the correct answer. Cayenne? Do you understand me? Then the guys, listen, listen to me. If you speak all together, I can't hear anyone. So when you want to speak, raise your hand, please, okay? If you want to ask me a question, raise your hand. Because if everybody speaks, I can't hear anyone. Yeah? So we got the second one. We got the suitcases. Let's go with number three. Sean, read number three for us, please. The child who's wearing pink and yellow shirts is washing the boat. Okay, perfect. Washing the boat. Good. If you don't have washing, you need to write down washing. Well done. Good job. Let's go to number four. Adam. Yes. Number four, please. The sun is coming out from behind the cloud. 
Uh huh. Perfect. The sun. Well done. And we have number five. Number five. Let's go with Elaine. Elaine, number five. Okay. What do you have, sweetie, number five? Sweetie, do you have the answer, number five? No. No, okay. So tell me if you don't have it. Don't worry about it. Just tell me. Here, Lydia, do you have... That's okay, sweetie. You're doing great. No worries. Lydia? I don't know the answer to number five. Okay. Charmaine, do you know the answer number five? I don't know. You don't know. Who knows the answer to number five? Me. Okay, Chloe, tell me. No fair. A towel on a boy's shoulder has blue and yellow stripes on it. I'm so sorry. Perfect, sweetie. Answer yes. This. Very well, sweetie. Good job. Let's look at this. The towel. Let me get my pencil. Let me show you. The towel on the boy's shoulder has blue and yellow stripes on it. Here it is. This is the towel. Oh, let me change the pencil. I'll take it black. So this is the towel and it has stripes. It has yellow stripe. Uh, sorry. It has blue stripe. Then it has yellow stripe. Blue stripe, yellow stripe, and so on. So the answer is the towel on the boy's shoulder has blue and yellow stripes on it. Okay, now you have to have these answers, all right? These are the correct answers. Now, I'm going to give you five minutes break, go to the toilet, drink some water, change computer, and come back, all right? Yeah, see you in five right. minutes. All right. Okay. Are we all back? Yes. Okay. Now let's see. <laughs> done breaking. <laughs> or the break is done, is finished. Okay. Um, Jolene asked me a question. Where do you write your answers? Do you write the answers in the book? or in your notebook? Charmaine, where do you write the answers? Do you write the answers in the book or in the, in the book. notes in the book? Okay, so when you have a task from the book like this, you can write the answers here, okay? So you can write the answer here. But if there is something that we do that is not in the book, you are going to write in your notebook, okay? <coughs> yes? Do you understand this? Okay. Okay. So when we have a task from the book, you write in the book with pencil. Don't use pen. With pencil, because if you make a mistake, you can just erase it and write it down the correct one. Good. Okay, so this is done. Mm. But let's see, uh, Elaine, what picture do you like better? Do you like picture A or picture B? I like picture A. Picture A, why do you like picture A? Mm. 
because the bird is beautiful. Are you like the birds over there? Yes. Uh huh. Okay. Good. Uh, how about Cayenne? What picture do you like? Do you like picture A or picture B? Which one, sweetie? The first one or the second one? A or B? First one. Aha. Uh -huh. Why do you like the first one? Because the flag is beautiful. Ah, okay, sweetie. Perfect. Good. Thank you very much. Now, let's see, uh, Adam, tell me about this girl over here. Let me take my pen still. And let me take a ticker and let me change in my favorite color, which is blue. Tell me about this girl. What is the girl doing? Uh, the girl is fishing. Perfect. <laughs> the girl is fishing. Okay. I'm going to write that down. So... Do, 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 do. The girl is fishing. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Yeah. Need to write in not put or not. No need. Ah, sweetie, I didn't understand that. That was too loud. Okay. So, the girl is fishing. Okay, good. And where are these two boys? Charmaine, where are these two boys? Where are they? They are walking. Um, they are walking. But where are they walking? Are they walking in a park, in a mountain, in the school? Where are they walking? Besides me. Uh, Chloe, who are you chatting with? Chloe? I wanted to click everyone. Somehow I, I managed to click only Jolene. Yes, okay, sweetie, but you can chat now. Now we're having a class, so we have to learn something. Thank you. Yeah? So no chatting in the chat box, please, guys. Okay, so, uh, Charmaine, where are the boys? Maybe at the beach? Oh, okay. Inside the sea. By the sea. That was a very good answer. Perfect. By the sea. Good. By the sea. Good. Perfect. Okay, maybe they will go at the beach, maybe. Uh, Elaine, do you like to go at the beach? Teacher, they yeah. like to go right in the notebook or not? Yes, you have to write everything in the notebooks, everything. Elaine, do you like to go to the yes. beach? Yes. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Good. What can you do at the beach? I can swim. I can swim. Perfect. I can swim. Mm -hmm. Can you read the book? Can you yes, look at I the beach? Can. Yes, yes, good job. I can. Good job, sweetie. Yes, I can. Very well. Yes, I can. Excellent. That was very good. Thank you. All right. Yeah. So, because some people live nearby the beach, but some people need to travel to go 
at the beach. So where I live, there is no beach over here. I need my suitcase. I need to put my clothes inside. And then I need to travel somewhere to go to the beach. Let me show you the next picture. Yeah, to go with this one. Okay, now let's look at this picture. Hmm. Teacher, I never copy finish the. Okay, the... so you can, you can write them down. I'm here, I'm waiting. So now we have another picture have over here. Okay, That's okay, guys. Then... Okay. You can write down, you can copy. We're doing nothing else. I'm just speaking. Once you're done, raise your hand. Okay, Sean is ready, perfect. Elaine is ready. Chloe is ready. Roseanne is ready. Awesome. Good. So no rush. Okay. We're going slowly. But you need to write that in the notebook because that's important. Uh, super duper ready. All right. Well done. Super duper. <laughs> that's awesome. Olivia is ready. Okay. So, Cayenne, Charmaine, Adam. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, Charmaine is ready. Adam, are you ready? Uh, no. No? Okay. Cayenne, are you ready? No. No? Okay, we're waiting. All the others, open your book on the next page, which is page 11. And look at this picture. Just look at the picture very nice and think about what you see over here. Where are they? But don't say it. Just look and think. So, where are they? What are they doing? How many are there? Are they kids or adults, parents? So, just look at the picture. See what you can see. As many things as possible. Just look, look, look. Maybe somebody is sleeping. Maybe somebody is reading a book. Maybe somebody is drinking something. Let's see. Okay. Adam, are you ready? I'm almost ready. Almost ready. You're so slow. So slow. You need more time. I am ready to do the Natasha will be careful. My mother's on the phone. 
Kitty, that's okay. All right, now. Cyan is ready as well. All right, perfect, good. Now, uh, let's see. Mm. Where is this photo? Where are the, all these people? Roseanne, where are these people? They are at the airport. Bravo, sweetie. Well done. They are at the airport. Good. Perfect. Sean, what are they doing at the airport? They are waiting. Ah, they're waiting. Okay. Okay. Fidi, you have two cameras. Okay, you have two accounts, so I can hear myself double. Okay. Uh, Charmaine, how many children can you see? Four children. Four children. Okay, good. Elaine, um, how many women can you see? Women or moms? I think four. Four women. Mm -hmm. eh? No. Okay. All right. Perfect. Now, how many men are there, Adam? How many men are there? There are zero moms. There are three. Three? Let's see. One. So this is a man. One. Is this a man? Should be two. Okay. I can see just two men. Well, this is a boy. It's not a man. It's a boy. It's not a father, but he is a boy. Aha, uh -huh, okay. So where are they going? For Livia, where are all these people going? Are they going somewhere? They are going traveling. Oh, they're going traveling. Oh, interesting. And Jolene. Teacher, where do you write the I don't answer. write now, sweetie. I don't write now. Oh. Yeah, don't worry. I don't write now. <laughs> okay. Um, Jolene, how are they traveling? What? I, I can't hear that. How are they traveling? How are they traveling? Uh... How? Mommy. I... Are they walking? Are they flying? Are they swimming? How are they going walking. to travel? They are they they are gonna walk to the flight. Uh -huh. So they are going by plane. Uh -huh. Okay, they are going by plane. Okay. And I think they are going to. Yuza. Where are they going? Yuza. What is that? What is the USA? USA? Uh -huh. They're going to USA? Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. Interesting. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe they're going to USA. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Oh, interesting. What about this man? What is this man doing? Um, Elaine, what is he doing? He is reading the newspaper. Okay. Ah, so he's reading a newspaper. Perfect, good. Okay. How about this boy? Uh, Chloe, what is this boy doing? This boy is walking. This boy is 
This boy's wearing a jacket. He is walking while listening to music. Perfect. So he's walking and listening to music. Very well. Good. How about this woman over here, Cayenne? What is she doing? She's drinking a, co a coffee. Mm, perfect. She's drinking a coffee. Very well. Okay. And how about this a girl or a young mom or just a girl? What is she doing, Adam? She is, uh, she is talking on the phone. No, she's, she's talking on the phone. Who is she talking with? Uh, I don't know. You don't know? I think, okay. I, I think she's talking with her husband, calling her to come here and fetch her. How do you know that he, she's talking with her husband? Big brain. Oh, big brain. <laughs> all right. Big brain. Good. So I will know all the answers for big brain. Okay, city, perfect. How about this person at the back? Uh, Roseanne, how about That's this good. woman over here? What is she doing? She is temporarily happy here. She's crying. Why is she crying? I think she lost the plane. The plane? Or maybe the ticket. She lost the ticket. She lost the plane. Or missed the plane. Okay, let's write it down. So we can say... Uh, just going to write it over here. Da, da. She missed her flight. Maybe the plane took off. Flew away. She missed her flight. Now she's crying. So she missed her flight or she lost her ticket. <gasps> Where's my ticket? She can't go on a plane because she lost her Ticket. She lost her ticket. Okay, perfect, good. Look at this. We have now we have six questions over here that we need to answer. So first I want you to think, look at the picture. And just think, what can we answer? How so the old are yes, really? the four child? children? The four children. children. Yeah. How old are the four children? What do you think? The children are. The children are. So I'm going to write that over here. The children are. How old do you think they are? Teacher. Teacher. Yes, Elaine? I think it is 10 years old. Okay, you think they're 10 years old. Okay. That's good. Now, you need to answer all these five questions up till here. And then question number six. You need to write one sentence about this airport picture. You can say maybe like, what are they doing? Are they going to fly where? Are they waiting for the plane? Let's see what are you going to write about it. Okay, are we ready? Yes. All right, let's start. So. What's this? What is, what song is the boy in the jacket listening to? Steven okay, Taylor. I don't, 
you have to tell me because I have no idea. I think it's Stephen Doe's eyes on you. Okay, you write that down and then we'll see. So now you can write in the book, okay? But use pencil because if you make a mistake, you can just erase it. So we started with the first one. The children are... What did we say? Elaine said maybe 10 years old. So we can say, oops, not 190, 10. Maybe the girl is five and the boy is, let's say, maybe six. Okay. Or maybe they can be even older, freaker. Teacher. Yes, Elaine? The number two and number six, I don't know how to do it. Okay. Then go to number three. If you don't know the answer, go to number three. Okay. So, when you have a question that you don't know what to answer, skip it. Go to the next one. First, you answer the ones that you know that's important. Teacher, but I know it. I also do it already. Okay, sweetie, so skip that one. Go to the next one. You write the ones that you know. This, the three and four are hard for me. But Sviri, you need to think, what do you think that he's doing? What is he reading? I think he's reading about cartoons. Okay, you write that down. Yes, Sean? Are you ready? Yep. Perfect, well done. Mm -hmm. Diane is ready as well. Good. Finish. Okay, Chloe is ready as well. Awesome. Why don't you be like Sean? Sean raised his hand, so I know he's ready. Well done, I'm Sean. Done. Mm -hmm. Good. You done with our show. Yes, sweetie. Yes. Nine thirty-one. Yes, so? When are we going to end this class? At your 10? At 10, yes. We start at 8 and we finish at 10. Okay. Yeah. Are okay. you tired? Do you, do you want to sleep? No. Nope. Oh, you want to play a game? Not really. <laughs> anyway, I, just, I just feel more, I just feel exhausted. Exhausted from what? What did you do today? From um, class because it took so long. Oh, uh, I know. Well, we're almost there, so we're almost ready. Okay, let's start with the first one. Well, we got the first question. We answered. Charmaine, let's go to number two, sweetie. Ready. What? Is one of the passenger crying? She lost her ticket. Perfect. She lost her ticket. Good. Good job. Very well. She lost her ticket. Anybody else something different? Do we agree? She lost her ticket. Do we agree? Okay, good. Let's go to number three. What in the suitcase is Chloe? What's in the suitcases? Oh, clothes, toys, and many more. 
Okay, so we can see. There are some clothes, toys, and maybe other things. Things. Maybe, maybe a book. Maybe a game. Maybe a, a toothbrush. Um, yeah. Yes, sweetie? Can I say there are some clothes in the suitcase? Yes, you can. There are some clothes in the suitcase. Awesome. That's very good. I'll write that one down. There are some clothes in the suitcase. Awesome. There are some clothes in the suitcase. Good. Perfect. Okay, number four, Sean. The man is reading news. Okay, but we say about. What's the man reading about? The man reading newspaper about cartoons. Sean? Sean? About what's happening? Sweetie, I can't hear you one more time, please. About what's happening. Okay, about what's happening. Maybe we can say in the world. Happening in the world. Or about sports. The man is reading about what's happening in the world. The man is reading about sports. Okay, good. Now let's go to number five. Herlivia, number five. What song is the boy in the jacket listening to? The boy... The boy is listening to music. Mm -hmm. But what song, sweetie? We know that he's listening music. But what song? Maybe we can say, the boy is listening to an English song. Maybe. Or oh, Chinese song. Or Malaysian yeah. song. Yes, Chloe? I think the answer is Stephen Jones, I don't know. Hey, you think that he's listening to that song. That's okay. Good. Perfect. So we know that the boy is listening to something. But the question is, what song? So we can say, the boy is listening to an English song. I don't know the name. We can say, I don't know the name. I don't know the name. He's listening to some song. Okay, and we got the last one. Number six is the most difficult one. <laughs> now let's see what is going on in this picture. So, Jolene, what did you write over here? He disappeared. He's not here. Oh, no. Okay. Roseanne, what do you have, sweetie, number six? The four children are playing with the toys, and one boy is listening to his favorite song, Freddy, and they uh, wait for the flight and enjoy. Amazing, sweetie. Very well. Good. Perfect. Okay, Chloe, what do you have? She's writing. Sorry, teacher. I, I just... But here is my answer. I wasn't supposed to write, but okay. It's busy at the airport. A man is reading a comic about cartoons. Okay, good. The rest of the children 
One mom is carrying a giant teddy bear. Two suitcases are next, are next to the blank seat, next to the mat. Perfect. Good, good. Yes, Jolene? Sorry, teacher, I just logged out of the, of the room. Okay, do you have number six? Number six. Uh, yeah. Uh, Almost finished. Now it's nine. Chloe. Number six, I don't know. Sad face. Jolene, do you have number six, sweetie? I can't hear you. No, I don't have. You don't have it. Okay, Olivia, do you have number six? No. No. No, you don't have number six. Okay. Uh, Adam, do you have number six? Uh, no. No. Okay, who has number six? Me. Sean? Mm hmm Tell me, sweetie, what do you have number six? I didn't manage to write anything. There's not much going on that I can think of. Okay, can you read it for us, please? Maybe one of them. The passengers just went out of the plane. Okay, good. That's all? That's all. Mm -hmm. Oh, God, okay. Much. Nothing more. Mm. All right. Fair enough. Okay, so we can say a lot of things. For example, we can say, uh, the people are at the airport. Some children are playing with their, whoops, with their toys. With their toys. A man is reading the newspaper. One woman is drinking coffee. What else can we say? We can say, one boy is listening to some music. My eyes are becoming ready. Okay, good. So, if you have these answers, that's okay. If you want to write number six, you can copy just number six from me. You can write it down. And then we're going to listen to something, okay? So copy just number six. I hope the rest is correct. 4B. My friends and my pets. 3E. Spots and stripes. Listen and look at the picture. There is one example. Well, I'm ready if anyone wants it. Okay, Chloe. Thank you. Why is So with the last question, we just say what we see in the photo. We can say many things. This is just a basic what we can say here. Once you're ready, raise your hand. Okay, perfect. Elaine is ready. Cheyenne is ready. Well done. Chloe is ready. Now, on the next 
picture. Do, 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 do. Where is it? Where is it? Uh, so in the book, you can see the photo, right? We can see all the photo. But can you see this man? What is this? What's his face? What's this? What is it called this that he has over here? Roseanne? What is it called this, sweetie? Mustache. Call mustache. Uh -huh. This is mustache. If it's over here, this is a mustache. But this is called beard. Beard. Okay, let me write it down for you. So, the man with the beard. The man with the beard is reading the newspaper. Newspaper. The man with the beard, this is called the beard. What color is his beard? Roseanne? It's brown. Well done. So the man with the brown beard is reading a newspaper. Now, we're going to listen something about this picture. So I just want you to listen and look at the picture, okay? Yeah? Okay. All right. Let's listen. So I'm just going to stop sharing and I'm going to share it again. Teacher, the number six can never write finish yet. You didn't finish them? No. Teacher, I take photo already. Okay, you can write them down. Can you see it now? Yes. Okay. But also we're going to listen to something now, but we're going to listen twice. So listen, everybody, and look at the picture. 3E. Spots and stripes. Listen and look at the picture. There is one example. I like this picture. It's great. Can you see the man who's sitting down? Yes, I can. He's reading a newspaper. That's right. Colour his beard brown. OK. I'm doing that now. Can you see the man with the brown beard? Now you listen and colour and write. One. Now find the boy who's walking with his mother. I can see him. He's taller than his brother. Yes, he is. Colour his trainers purple, please. OK, I can do that. Two. Would you like to do some writing now? Yes, please. I like writing. Good. Look at the board that's on the wall. The large one. OK. Write times on the top of that. The people need to know when the planes are arriving and leaving. Yes, that's really important. Three. Now, can you see the woman who's drinking some hot coffee? The one whose feet you can't see. That's right. Colour her skirt. OK. Can I colour it green? I'd like you to make it blue, actually. Right. I'll do that now. Four. And now write something else in the picture. Fine. What shall I write? 
Well, can you see the bag? The one that's in front of the girl in shorts? Yes, that one. Can you write sport on it, please? OK, that's easy. Five. And what else can I colour? I know. Can you see the two children who are playing with the model planes? Yes. Shall I colour one of those? No. Colour the flower on the little girl's dress. Make it orange. I love that colour. It's my favourite. There. Brilliant. Thank you. Teacher. 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 Okay, it is finished. Teacher, I can hear you. No. Okay, so now take some colors, some pencil colors, anything you have, okay? And if you don't have any colors, Sean, hold on a second, please. And if you don't have colors, you're just going to write the answers like this. Let me show you. So he said that... The man had brown beard. You're just going to write brown beard. If you don't have colors, okay? If you have colors, you can color. If you don't have, you just write down brown beard. Are you ready to listen again? Yeah, let's go. One more time. 3E. Spots and stripes. Listen and look at the picture. There is one example. I like this picture. It's great. Can you see the man who's sitting down? Yes, I can. He's reading a newspaper. That's right. Colour his beard brown. OK. I'm doing that now. Can you see the man with the brown beard? Now you listen and colour and write. So get ready now, okay? Again, if you have the colour, you just colour what you hear. If you don't have colours, write down brown beard, for example. All right? So I'm going to stop once we listen. One. Now find the boy who's walking with his mother. I can see him. He's taller than his brother. Yes, he is. Colour his trainers purple, please. OK, I can do that. What was the answer? Purple trainers. Purple trainers, good. Purple trainers. Okay. Let's keep listening. Two. Would you like to do some writing now? Yes, please. I like writing. Good. Look at the board that's on the wall. The large one. Okay. Write times on the top of that. The people need to know when the planes are arriving and leaving. Yes, that's really important. Uh-huh. Now, what was the answer now? Times. The Times? We, we have to write the book at, at the word time. Perfect. So, is that over here? Yeah. Perfect. So we need to write times. Very well. Good. So we put times 
on the board. Perfect. Okay, let's keep listening. Three. Now, can you see the woman who's drinking some hot coffee? The one whose feet you can't see? That's right. Colour her skirt. Okay. Can I colour it green? Okay, what was the answer? The, the answer uh, the, the answer is the la lady at the is the lady that lady is drinking coffee. We have to color the skirt green. Aha! The skirt it's must blue. be the is blue. Blue, blue skirt. Yes, it's blue. It's not green. It's blue skirt. skirt is blue. blue skirt. Well done. Okay. Let's see the next one. Yeah. I'd like you to make it blue, actually. Right. I'll do that now. So it's a blue skirt. Perfect. Good. Okay. Let's see the next one. Four. And now write something else in the picture. Fine. What shall I write? Well, can you see the bag? The one that's in front of the girl in shorts? Yes, that one. Can you write sport on it, please? OK. That, that's easy. What is the next one? The next one is... The girl in front of Joe, so why does it sound like a money from you? What is the next one? The the girl the girl that wears shirts in the front we have to uh, write sports in it. Is it here? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. And what do we need to write? Sports. Sports. Perfect. So we need to write sport on this bag over here. Hello? Good. Good. Now we go to the next one. Five. Four. And what else can I color? I know. Can you see the two children who are playing with the model planes? Yes. Shall I colour one of those? No. Colour the flower on the little girl's dress. Make it orange. I love that colour. It's my favourite. There. Brilliant. OK. What was the last one? The last one is the little girl that's playing with the piano. The we flower orange color is the flower. Is this one over here? Is that yes. the one? Yes. What color is the flower? Orange. Orange. Good job. Orange flower. Orange. Yes. So. Now we have all the answers. Well done. Perfect. Uh, Peter, Good. I have to say something. It's almost time to end class. Okay, sweetie. We have three more minutes, so we'll finish in a second, okay? Okay. Now, let me show you what you need to do for your homework. So, when you log into your account, okay, did you do unit one? Did you do unit one? Uh, yeah. Okay. So now you have to do unit, if you haven't done them, unit 2B and 2C. 
this is going to be your homework. If you haven't done them, if you finish them, that's good. Okay? Teacher, how can I see it? Okay. Okay. Elaine, okay. Elaine, sweetie, I can't help you with that. You need to log into your account. So when you log in, you can see if you've done this or not. But you have to do this too. Okay? Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right. Yes, Sean? Can you Sweetie, I can't hear you. I'm sorry, but I can't hear you. I don't understand you. I can't send you the link. You need to log in. So when you're going to log into your account, you're going to see the page, and then you're going to do your homework. So you need to log into the platform. Okay? Yes. Okay. All right. Well done. In that case, we are done for okay. today. Thank you very much, guys. I'll see you next week. Bye. 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 Bye.